Hello there, Virgos. It's me, Lex, and welcome to your reading. If you have not already, please subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you're notified when I post new content or do live streams. If you would like to reach me directly, the link to my website is in the description box below, okay? And that's going to be victoryforhope.com. So I have already pre-shuffled and drawn your cards. I will go through them in the order in which they came out and then rearrange and clarify as necessary, okay? All right, so I've already pre-shuffled and drawn your cards. Sorry about that. I had to pause it for some noise, but I've already pre-shuffled and drawn your cards. I will go through them in the order in which they came out and then rearrange and clarify as necessary. OK, so we have balance. Life experience. The magician. Three of earth. Two of fire. And the chariot. Crowning the overall energy of your reading. I have listened to your intuition. With three of fire. Okay. So Virgos, I feel that things are really looking good for you. I do feel that new opportunities are about to present themselves. I feel that there um, are a lot of things that's kind of happening, okay, with this life experience and magician. Um, you're getting a lot of the things that you wanted, but it is coming with some extra things that you didn't predict. And it's telling you um, right now you need uh, moderation, okay? And you're going to have to compromise with a lot of different people, okay? But this three of fire and the listen to your intuition crowning it is saying to go ahead and make long-term plans because you're getting what you wanted. This magician, you have all the tools, baby, to manifest what you want, okay? You have all the resources. Get ready, get ready. Make long-term plans is what it says, okay? Chariot two of fire and three of earth being present here as well. You may be partnering up with someone or um, that you're going to have to cooperate and compromise with. You may not necessarily want to, but it's going to be for your highest good because I do see that you're being recognized for the work that you're doing, for being a team player and working and cooperating with whoever this person or people may be. And um, you are being noticed. OK, you are shining bright with this chariot. This is my movement card. This is happy outcomes. Public recognition is on this again. And it's just so bright and beaming all the sun and the light on him. And that is why I'm saying you're being recognized some, for some work that you've done. OK, so let's get a couple of extra clarifiers here for this. <clears throat> see what other tidbits of information if this is a romantic situation a romantic partnership okay this decisions okay you could be dealing with the gemini i just actually did their reading so you may want to go back and watch that if it is a romantic partnership that is going on here that you're needing to compromise with it is telling you to do so um or you may have just realized that you're ready for something more either with them or someone else, but you want more from whoever this is. If it's work, you're wanting more responsibilities. You want a better position. You want more money. If it is a love situation, you're wanting a, a stronger, more significant commitment. Okay. That is what I'm getting there. Now we're going to, uh, I want to pull a life purpose oracle for you as well. end up being two gemini end up being two <laughs> whatever comes out is what comes out that's your message right so we have talked to your angel angels instead of worrying ask for divine guidance it says and i also have leadership take charge of the situation okay so like i said you're going to be noticed you're going to be recognized you may be promoted to a leader or you may just need to um, like I said, when you listen to the intuition, talk to your angels, pray, meditate, whatever it is that you do to get centered and grounded, to get balanced. OK, do that so that you can do what you need to do in this situation. OK, Virgos. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to pull Whisper of Love Oracles to see what is going on with you in love. All right. Okay. These three came out together, but 
it's a it's a couple with different ways I'm seeing it. Okay, so first card we have is deception. Someone's wearing a false mask in this relationship. I have release your ex. It is time to clear the energy. Pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. And I have love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. All right. So that situation up there was the romantic situation. You are wanting something more and you need to make sure that you are clear about that. Okay. Um, there may be some red flags that you saw in other people, but what I'm getting here is two different ways, two different ways. I'm saying this. Some of you just need to move the hell on from an ex or someone that ought to be your ex and you keep holding on to it. You have all the signs, you have the warnings. Okay. Some of you are deflecting. Okay. It could be because of an ex or past situation, but some of you are deflecting your own insecurities and your own issues and your own red flags onto other people because you may not be really saying what you should really say, what you are really feeling. You're not doing the things that you really want to do. And you're the one that's putting on the mask. And you're looking for red flags that are not really there. Okay. So two sets of ways I'm looking at this, whichever group you fit into, make the necessary adjustments, Virgo. Okay. All right. So before we go, I'm going to pull an Archangel Oracle to tie this all in. And we have clear audience. Notice the loving guidance you hear inside your mind or from other people. Okay. Listen to your own intuition. Do what you got to do and then take action, Virgo. All right. So this is your reading. If this resonates with you, please give me a thumbs up. Give me a comment. Share it with a fellow Virgo or a Virgo that you feel may need to hear the message. Cross watchers, thank you for being here. If this fits your situation, let me know. If it does not resonate at all, Virgo, that is all right. Please check out one of the other videos that highlights one of your moon rising or Venus signs as those do sometimes resonates with us more. If you do not see your video up, do not fret because all of them will be posted by the end of the week. OK, so um, to reach me again, um, like I said in the beginning, the website link will be in the description box. OK, you can book coaching, you can book readings, you can book a class with me. Or you can visit the shop. I have a lot of good stuff over there. Okay. So until next time, Virgos, I love you. Take care.